Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin, if you've met me for the first time and today we are looking at the small rig, a brand new chip on board light, the small rig RC 220D, daylight balance light and we're going to compare it with the um, Aperture 200D. There's a lot to talk about these guys. Ready? Um, if you're new to this channel, welcome. Here is the light from Smorik, portable, but very similar to the Aperture one. Well, well not Aperture, Amara. And I'm going to show a comparison uh, later in the video. I'm not going to do anything scientific, but we're going to compare how these lights compare, build quality. If you're deciding which is going to be your light moving forward, I'm sure I can help you do that. All right. And stick that guy in here. Check out the video for the ND filter in another video. Check it out. It's awesome. Actually, I'm using the ND filter right now. So we're going to see how their ND filter with their light. We're going to see in a second. But for now, guess what? It's lighting us. It's the Amaron 20D. It's already at work. And right there, it's standing a distance away. Put it at 100% right now. And I'm going to put this guy on that same mounting point. Same distance eventually so we can have an idea how these guys look and it's in the soft lantern um soft box of zome we checked it out during the review of the gvm light which we, we saw that zome it's the same size as the small rig one so small rig don't don't get it twisted small rig but big vision once again similar just like the aperture brick power power brick you know similar quality pretty long wire too hmm that's nice Okay, let's see how uh, what the stepless is like. Percentage, it's one percent per step, so um, it's moving one, two, three, four in terms of percentage. Not bad. Ooh, and uh, yeah, they have a small rig logo on this uh, on the. Uh, I like it, small rig logo. Other companies don't have their logo on it, but Smurrick got to sell. <laughs> they have to sell everything. Sell themselves real good. So let's have this on so we can get the actual output. Let's see. 43%. Oh. 69, 90, 92, 94, 100. Oh my God, this is Ghostville. What? Let's take that down. Very bright. I gotta give it to them. Of course, there are other things, there are other effects, which I'm not really a fan of. The other stuff uh, from this, the stuff which of course you can see, brightness and quality is all I'm really after. There's an app you can you know control do more with with an app flash some of those effects okay so i'm interested in the white light uh how bright and how much quality if there's any tint take note now this is a hundred percent from that light with the sub box uh aperture um i'm around 200d i'm going to switch it to this one so now let's get the sub box on are you ready Okay, study, ready to go full blown. Oh no. 
Wow. Does it take about a second or two to turn on? Let's try it again. On. See, no light, but it comes. Hmm. You like that? Do you like that? I don't know. But the light seems very good. Seems like good quality light. Now let's get this out of here. Quick look. Same size, 26 inch. All right, 100% from Small Rig. So this light right now is the Small Rig Arrow C220D along with its own lantern. This is what you get at a distance, same spot. What do you guys think? What do you think? I'm feeling good. Now, let me help you decide. Uh, first of all, well, not first of all, last of all, because I should have said this at the beginning. Small Rig did not send this light to me. Um, neither did I purchase it with my own hard-earned money. Uh, but Amazon sent it out to me to review. Now, I don't have to be in any way uh, nice to Small Rig, so, um, you know, I can say what I want and be justified. And I think these lights are great. I think I think they are in, they are just the, probably the same thing with the Amaran. Now, I in my opinion, you can't go wrong with any of these two lights, Aperture or Small Rig. The quality of light and material, they are like on point the same. Now, here's how I'm going to help you judge it if you are like me and you already have a couple of aperture lights it's hard to switch if you are starting out like a youtube channel or you're starting out your production company you might go with the sets now because i think they have a 120 daylight and 120 by color those are their uh, smallest lights they have a small rig uh, 220d which is this one we are being lit on and um, as well as the 220B, which is the bicolor. I'm not going to go out to buy more small rig stuff because I have a couple from Aperture. Let me show you this. Now, you see this? I'm just saying also so that you can also watch out for the review. This is the Aperture Spotlight and the review is coming up soon. Okay. I bought it with my money. Okay. So, it wasn't sent, it wasn't free of charge. I bought it. So I'm gonna do a review on it and tell, let you know. But bottom line, what I'm saying is, having invested in a couple of um, aperture lights, I have the 120D, 200D, 200X, I have the 100X and uh, you know, the 60D. You know, I'm getting there. I'm, I'm not planning to buy the 300D. I might go for the 600 d pro 600 pro or 600 c uh, depending on uh, my decision in the future but i'm already getting there now uh, i'm going to hold on to the small rig because um, i like it you know i probably use leave it here and use it in the studio and i know that when i'm going to the field to shoot it's all aperture lights and i'm not even touching the one in the studio if you are starting out you can go with either of them um, by the time you are ready financially to get some more or better light, Smaru will probably have uh, been there to drop their spotlight, their um, floodlight, their 300D, their uh, 600 or even 1200, like uh, 1200, like Aperture has today. Okay, so um, you, you can't go wrong.
But this is for somebody out there, small rig 6K Pro cage. Ah, uh, somebody needs this. Let me know in the comments right now. I'm not gonna wait two weeks. I might do it today. I might send it, I might, if you want it right now, I say, I'll give it to you right now. Comment below, I'm not waiting two weeks. One of the 49 items for giveaway. If you don't know, check the link here to find out what we're giving out. In fact, I don't know all what we are giving out because uh, it comes by the minute, by the day, by the weeks. You know, some companies are going to sponsor eventually and support. So don't forget, let me know if you want this, you got it. Like, subscribe, comment, and I guess I'll see you in the next video. Peace.